Jerry Jones and his entourage arrived at Valley Ranch for the Big D debut of Jimmy Johnson. If first impressions did last forever, Jimmy Johnson would have been doomed. And it hurts me when someone says I did something out of disrespect to Tom Landry. If I did, I'm sorry. His introduction to Dallas, mostly an apology for replacing a legend. But he has some fences to mend before he wins back the fans. Several of the callers promised to cancel their season tickets. Those fans not so quick to forgive. And I don't think I'll become a Cowboys fan purely because of Jimmy Johnson. But he only asked for one thing. Yeah, I played with him just to help us out. Hey, we're trying to do the right thing. A soft-spoken plea You're on the wrong field to have asthma. turned hard-nosed demands. Right, Get out of here. Yesterday, he blasted several players for being out of shape. Jeff Zimmerman nearly dropped from exhaustion. In his first few months on the job, Johnson was a culture shock to the fans, players, and city. But beneath all the trials and tension, okay, ready to go to work. A winner was taking shape. You know, you got to control yourself mentally to where you can put a smile on your face, you can be upbeat, you can be positive, um, and you can work toward uh, making improvement. At his first training camp, Johnson gave WFAA a peek inside his daily routine, a chance to see the passion and purpose that would eventually win over players, win over fans, and win a lot of games. I can go to sleep and I can know that we're going to get up the next day and I'm going to be doing something that I truly love and that's coaching football. Proving that first impressions don't last forever. How about them Cowboys? But champions do. In Dallas, I'm Chris Sadegi. I'd be curious if Chris could check back in with some of those people that gave the sound bites about how, yeah, I'm not going to watch the Cowboys because of Jimmy Johnson. I wonder if they take it back. I wonder if they'd have an apology. <laughs> I think they'd probably take it back pretty quickly. <laughs> Uh, boy, what a legacy uh, he had and, and the impact he made on those early Cowboys teams. I'm glad he is finally getting the recognition he deserves. It's uh, well-earned and a long time coming. Yeah, and we love to see people get their flowers while they're Absolutely. there to accept them. Yep.